Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back. If you're new, welcome. And um, today we're going to unbox the June Boxy Lux box. It'll have eight items in it. And I, the choice window was like over a month ago, so I have no idea what I chose. I don't remember. I don't. I never do, but like, this is why. It takes another month after I choose for the box to even get to me. So by then, it, it, a whole world has happened. You know? You know what I mean? Um, that said, I do have a little announcement to make, okay? Um, I'm going to take a break next week because uh, homie, homie needs a break. Homie needs a break, okay? Um, this is one of my final Pride looks. This is based off of the trans flag. I do have one more look that I need to do because my Gabo requested it and my Gabo gets what my Gabo wants. So I have one more look to do for Pride, but obviously it's not going to happen during Pride Month. So you're just going to have to deal with us being louder and prouder um, all year round because you know what? People are gay all year round too. You know what? Did you know that? Did you know? Did you think it only happened during Pride Month? No. They're gay all year. Yeah. So we're just going to celebrate all year. Um, so yeah have one more pride look that I need to do. I'm not sure if I'm going to film it with the channel or if I'm just going to do it, <laughs> but um, I need a break from filming and all that jazz. So yeah, I'm going to take a, I'm going to take a break next week and then I'll see you the week after, but that's just, that's my announcement. Okay. Enough rambling. Let's get into this box because something smells amazing in here. I don't know what it is. Again, I don't know what's in here at all. Um, okay. Let's just uh, dive right in, shall we? Um, okay, first up I'm seeing Iconic London Sheer Blush. What is this? Okay. Formulated with a unique gel to watercolor texture. This blendable and buildable blush melts right into skin to give you a soft lip from within flush. This retails for $27. I feel like that's a little expensive, but okay. So this is in shade Rose Riot. Okay, interesting, interesting. So it's got like a little peekaboo window there. I mean, that's a that's a good shade for me. So, what is this? Okay, so you just it just it just oh okay. I feel like that was a lot. I just uh, I just did that. We just did it. But it, that is like a shade that I like to do, like kind of on the apple, and then like I go deeper, uh, further back, and kind of blending in with the contouring. So that wouldn't be a bad shade for me. Let's just kind of sheer that out a little bit. Yeah, I mean that's a cute shade. That'll that'll work well for my my pastiness. Um, up next, we have something from Patrick Taw. That's fancy. I've never had anything from him before. Major Glow Up Shine. A universally flattering high shine lip gloss with the cushion and slip of a lip balm for zero stickiness all shine. That is $22. Um, I know he is a kind of fancier, higher price brand, so I'm not surprised at that. This is shade She's Expensive. Ooh, I like it. I want to be expensive. Oh, that is gorgeous. Okay. Okay, Patrick TA. I see you. That is beautiful. Okay, I can't wait to try that. Gorgina. Okay. Up next, we have Discovery Eyeshadow Palette came to play from Rare Beauty. Why do I feel like this is going to be, like, neutral? I just have a horrible feeling. 
I don't think I've tried any like rare beauty eyeshadow though. This is a very odd shape. <gasps> okay, no, I am very happy with that color story. Are you kidding me? The purples that sparkle. Oh my god, I have to. Oh, glitter. Yes. Glitter everything. Okay. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Okay, I can't wait to play with that. Ooh. All right. So let's see what this says about that. Inspired by Selena's playful side, these berry and rose based shades celebrate the ever changing colors we reflect every day. Discover easy to wear combos you don't have to think about with seven rich buttery shades in a range of finishes from matte to duochrome plus a 3D glitter top coat. That's the center shade that I just freaked out about. Oh, oh, do you see that reflect? Hello, okay. To add shimmering dimension to any look. Well, you know I'm going to go there. I'm going to go there. Absolutely. Okay, that retails for $29. I mean, for seven shades, it's 20 That seems a little overpriced, but, you know, celebrity. Celebrity, uh, what am I trying to say? Celebrity brands, you know? Okay. What's this? We got a little Nas, a little Nas going on, a little lipstick it looks like. Bad reputation. Ooh. Now I'm gonna have Taylor swept in my head. Thanks. Bad reputation. Bad reputation. Okay. Ooh, that is a red. Okay. Okay, I'm not mad at that. Ooh, it's got like a nice like matte uh, feel to the thing too. I'm not big on like lipsticks. I'd rather have a liquid lip, but I'm not mad at that color. That's beautiful. No rules, just lips. A new formula, dynamic blend of moringa and passion fruit seed oils enhances color vibrancy and conditions lips for radically lightweight wear and unprecedented feel. Endless artistry, infinite expression. That retails for $26 for a tiny little lips. Are you, Nars, my goodness, get it together. Yeah, I feel like they're always very overpriced. Okay, so we have a Limus clarifying clay wash, skin, skin clearing facial wash for blemish prone skin. I'm not really blemish prone. My skin's pretty clear. I may, I may give this away to someone, actually. But I'm gonna snip it, because I'm me, and I have to snip things. Interesting. It... I don't know how to explain how that smells. It kind of reminds me of, like, springtime perfume but like older lady but not like grandma do you know what I mean do you, do you like a, a nice like late 40s woman like your your aunt your cool aunt with a springtime perfume does that make sense okay I'm crazy like I said I'm probably not gonna use that because it's more for acne prone skin and I'm that's not my skin um, deeply cleanse pores and reduce the look of blemishes with this purifying facial wash, specifically formulated for oily or blemish prone skin, which is not me, but I do know the perfect person for that. Gabo, you're getting some skincare, boo-boo. Um, the non-drying formula is infused with kaolin clay to lift away excess oils and daily impurities, hawthorn extract to help leave the skin feeling soothed, and baldo leaf extract to improve the look of skin clarity. This balancing cleanser also helps to visibly improve the look of skin texture whilst, 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 thank you, minimizing the look of blackheads and post-blemish discoloration. Gentle enough for daily use to it leaves skin looking clearer, less oily, and more even with every wash. And that retails for $49. A limus is expensive. That's expensive. Okay. Like that's what they sell on the cruise ships and the spa. 
I only know this because I got to have a spa room once because I got a free upgrade. <laughs> okay. What is this? Trans transport. What? Okay, there's not really anything to go off of on that, so let's look it up on here. Psalm Institute Transport Exfoliating Glycolic Acid Pads. Okay, gently exfoliate and treat your skin, taking it to a whole new level. Transport powered by MDT5 features saturated soft cotton pads designed to help improve skin tone, texture, and clarity and an 8% buffered AHA to gently exfoliate dead cells on the skin's surface. That retails for $65, which I feel like is very expensive. What was this? Like, okay, 50 treatment pads for $65. That's still a little expensive, but okay. Not as bad, I guess. You know what I mean? Like, if you math it out, I'm not gonna do the math. I'm not mathing. No, I'm in no state of mind to be mathing right now. Thank you. Okay. Let me glow illuminating serum from Keys. I've never heard of this brand. Okay, Keys Soul Care. Let me glow illuminating priming serum with niacinamide. Okay. A hydrating illuminating complexion and makeup priming serum that reveals a healthy golden glow while helping brighten, plump, and smooth the look of your skin. That retails for $26. This seems like a big package too, so I'm not really mad at that. Golden Aura is the name of this. Let's see, because I don't really have a golden glow. I am pasty. I'm more of a glow stick kind of glow. Crack me like a glow stick, you know? Ooh, it's in a glass bottle. Ooh, fancy. I give myself permission to glow is on here. Why does that feel like the Marauders map? I saw him, I swear I'm up to no good. Okay, let's just, again, I have to pump everything out onto my hand and make a mess, cause that's me. I mean, Okay, that's not... Ooh. Oh. Okay, that's... That's not, like, a crazy... You know, I was expecting, like... Like a gold, you know... Uh, what am I trying to say? Liquid highlighter kind of thing. But that's really not crazy. That's not crazy. I like that. Ooh, and it has, like, a like clean scent to it. I like the smell. That's not the smell that I've been smelling though. I don't know what the smell is. Is it this? I mean, this is like sealed up though. I don't know. Maybe that is the smell I've been smelling. It's gotta be because this is the only other thing in the box. Okay. I don't know. Something smelled really, really good when I opened the box. Okay, this is... Where am I? Who am I? What am I doing? Okay, Dew of the Gods Fiji Fuji Collagen Whip Vitamin Mask. Vitamin cocktail, anyone? That Fiji glow really hits different. Rich, luscious, and thick electric kaolin infused with vegan collagen, vitamin C, and lychee extract. Brightens tones and lifts your skin while restoring its natural balance. Injected with hyaluronic acid, Fiji Fuji is all about that youthful, radiant glow. It's a party in the tropics and the vibe is Fiji chic. I kind of love that. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the Fijis, it's so beautiful there. All right, this retails for $42. I feel like that's a little cray cray. But, okay, I feel like this is gonna be like one of those like big, uh, what am I trying to say? Yeah, like the, the big containers, you know, like you have to put the mask on yourself. Get 
it off of me. Okay. Ooh, and again, it's a big glass container. I love when it's glass. Actually, okay, no, this isn't glass. It's just hard plastic. But still, if it looks elevated. You know what I mean? It's elevated. Okay. How do I open you? I can barely fit my hands around this. This is so big. Oh, okay. Thought I was gonna have to find a big strong man to open this up, my goodness. Okay, it smells like perfumed Play-Doh, but okay. Interesting, interesting. Well, I'm gonna try that out. So yeah, that was it. That's the whole shebang. Um, I will be trying everything except for the Olimus, which I will be giving to my little goblin because she has oily skin and that would be more for her skin type than mine. So that works out lovely. All right. So seven items to try and, uh, it's going to take me a while to get through all of this. So that was this. I'm taking a break. I will see you the week after next and, um, yeah, <laughs> if you're behind on my videos, now would be a great time to get caught up. All right, love you guys. See you in a week. Bye.